All right, let's pull it off. Oh, this is gonna fucking hurt. <laughs> Fuck, okay. If I tear up, please don't cry. Ah! Hey guys, in this video, obviously as you can read from the title, I will be waxing everything. Now, this is a new purchase. This is called Lansley. Um, wax warmer kit it's a self waxing kit and I saw it on Amazon and I was like hey you know what I should buy this and try this on camera so this is gonna be first impressions literally first impressions I just got this today and I just want to jump straight into this video because I'm really excited if you guys don't know I already tried a diva cup on camera if you guys want to see that video go check it out I'll go ahead and show you guys the box so this is the box so it says it's for face and body eliminates most stubborn unwanted hair great for body legs arms we're gonna be waxing everything okay we're gonna be waxing everything this is gonna be so fun so let's go ahead and open it and see what everything looks like okay so it comes in plastic okay so, ah, child, not me dropping everything. Okay, and then this is a spray. So this says pre-wax oil, and this was in the box. Interesting. So it says it's a pre-wax cleanser that removes any traces of oil, makeup, all of that from the skin. What else is in here? Let's see. So this is what the inside looks like. Let's go ahead and take this off. So this is the after wax oil. So they have a pre-wax oil, and then they have an after-wax oil. Now, we have the beads. Yeah. So, here are the hard wax beans. Let me show you guys. So, the back says instruction for use. Melt the wax in a warmer. Wax warmer protective collars. Interesting. Okay, and then they gave me some gloves. I already have gloves, so I didn't really need this, but gloves do come in this. And then they give you, like, the sticks that you're going to use to wax. Okay, and then they have, like, a booklet. They have a mini kit for instructions. I'm going to... Like, I feel like this is easy, but... I'm the type of person who never reads directions, but I'm going to do this for the sake of the video. But I don't really read directions, but I'll do it just for you guys. I'll actually try to get everything right. This sounds so easy. It sounds way too easy. I want to like, I want to jump in. I just plugged it in and I don't even know if you guys could see, but the light is very, very soft. So this is off. This is on. It's a very soft light. It's not super bright. Like, I had it on earlier and I could barely even see that it was on. But let's go ahead and get started. Now, it says in the directions to go ahead and just pour it in. That's what I'm going to do. Let's pour it all. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Do you guys see the beads? They're green. Okay, do I put the top back on? I don't know. I feel like I should. Let's put the top on. Ooh. Okay, I think that it's done. Let's see the consistency because they're, they said that it's supposed to be like... A honey consistency. 
I think this is good. This is good. This is like honey. So I'm going to turn it off. I'm going to just go ahead and turn it off. And let's start a waxing. I guess what I'm going to do is just test it on my arm first. And let's go from there. Gosh, I'm so excited. This is going to be the test. It's just a test. Okay, I need to let it cool down a little bit before I apply the rest, but yeah. Can you guys see that? Can you see that? I like how it's green. If you guys are getting anxious, like seeing me pull it like off of me, don't worry. I'm kind of anxious too, but I think this is fun. Okay. Alright, I'm about to rip it off. That wasn't bad. I see the hairs on it. Let me show you. I don't even know if you guys could see the hairs on it. Can you guys even see that? I feel like I wanted to show you because have you guys ever seen like those videos where they like rip hair off and then they show it and it just looks so cool. But let's just do my whole entire arm since that was literally nothing. Let's do my arms. Okay. I'm about to rip it off. Shit. My problem? Okay, I know what I did wrong with that. So what I need to do is I need to make the patches thicker and closer together. Because with this one, you see that like I absolutely suck at waxing myself correctly so yeah because you, do you see like the dried wax on my arm it's not consistent so I need to put it closer together but let's do it okay let's rub it in This oil, it smells a little bit like tea tree oil, but it's not as strong. Okay, let's do the other arm. The smell is kind of odd. I don't even know how to explain it. Like, it just smells like plastic. Like, it doesn't, it doesn't smell disgusting, but it does smell odd. Okay, let's go ahead and pull it off. I swear it's not bad. Like it, li I literally, like it's not like scorching pain. Now let's move on to my armpits, the exciting part. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put on the pre oil, ah, and just rub that in. Now let's get some wet. <laughs> All right, let's pull it off. Oh, this is gonna fucking hurt. <laughs> Fuck, okay. If I tear up, please don't cry. I couldn't even pull it all the way. Okay, right now. Okay, fuck. Oh my. That freaking hurt. Do you guys see the hairs? You guys see the hairs? It's not a ton of hair, but it's enough. This is the after. It did take a few times for me to get here. 
but it looks good. Okay, now, after my armpits, let's move on to my legs. rubbing alcohol near because when you wax yourself sometimes a little bit of wax can be left over and rubbing alcohol literally will take that all away really fast so make sure you have some if you do want to purchase this did I like this yes I do like it it is super painful but waxing is super painful um, only thing that I would say it is a little bit hard to build your wax with this because I was trying to do layers on top of each other and it was kind of hard so it left a lot of the little pieces of dried wax around even after I ripped everything off but overall I did enjoy this I will be using it again the hairs on my stomach and the hairs on my arms in particular are really fine so it was kind of hard for it to grasp those hairs so I had to go over it multiple times the stuff I did off camera because this was so painful like I didn't want you guys to see me screaming the whole video so that's the reason why I didn't show absolutely everything because it was really painful with razors you can cut yourself and that could lead to hyperpigmentation on any area that you are shaving but with waxing you can't cut yourself and it is a really good tool to use if you don't want your areas to darken due to like shaving so that is one of the things that I do like about waxing 
This was only $23, which is great. I feel like this was good for the price that I paid for it. I also like how easy it is to work. And everything that it comes with, the wooden sticks, the pre-oil, the after oil, and all of that stuff, I feel like it's definitely worth the price point. But I also feel like the more you wax, the more you get used to it. I just, I haven't waxed myself in forever, you guys. I haven't waxed since high school, so I think that's the reason why my reaction was so crazy, because girl, it hurts. It hurts really bad. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, please give me a thumbs up it really does help to support my channel and it helps with the algorithm and i love you guys so much thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in my next one bye